this is the current state of my room. Yeah. I used to be a stripper. Hey guys, it's Kayla. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you are new, you should subscribe and stay a while. And if you're not, then welcome back. So let's address the elephant in the room. I haven't posted in, let's just check how long actually, because I'm not quite sure. Let's do that really quickly. <laughs> Okay, so my last video was April 11th. January, February, March, April, May, June. So that's almost two months ago because it is currently, what's the date? Let's see. The day is the 9th. So it's basically been two months since I last posted. And by the time I post this video, it might be two months. I don't know when I'm posting this, but yeah, it's been quite the struggle. Let's just say that. Okay, so as you guys know, if you've been on my channel, it is my junior year of high school. And... I'm going to be a senior next year, but I'm pretty much at the end of junior year and it's really weird to think about. I felt like I was a freshman like yesterday, so that's kind of insane. But for a while, I was kind of struggling with school and it was really hard on me mentally and I couldn't focus on YouTube while um, my priority was school. So I took a step back and took a long break from YouTube. Ow, my hair. But I am planning on getting on back on the YouTube grind soon because it's almost summer. Literally, this is my last week of junior year. So, yeah. Um, that's gonna happen. But, yeah, it was really rough mentally. And I think once summer hits, I'll be in a much better mental place. So, I'm really excited about that. I was also doing volleyball for a while for, like, club. And that recently ended. I had my last tournament, um... Not last weekend, but the weekend before that, I think. I can't remember exactly when it was. But I had that. So my season's now over, and I've focused more on school. And also, I need to talk about my hair. I forgot about that. I chopped it all off, and I dyed it. Because why not? Hmm. Yeah, um... My hair's all gone. It's definitely weird. When I first got it cut, it was like that short. So it's definitely grown out and looks a lot better now. Yeah, my hair is short and it's also orange. But that's because I box dyed it twice. And if you bleach box dyed hair, it turns out like a really brassy, like orangey color. Like there, you can really see it right now. But that's okay. I honestly don't really care. I'm getting redone later and it's just not that important to me. I just needed to get the dead ends off because my hair was so damaged and like disgusting and yeah so i chopped it all off and it's so short now but that's okay i did that and i filmed this video like three times like update videos and i just never updated you guys never posted them so <laughs> here i am doing it again but i have filmed some videos that are going to be edited and posted don't remember how many maybe like a couple honestly because i know that i'm not gonna like some of the videos i filmed so you will have videos of me with long hair or me with shorter hair from before it's just all over the place but i'm going to be uploading a haul video from literally like two months ago two or three months ago <laughs> i will be uploading that soon i need to edit it still so yeah and i have long hair in that so there's that my haul video will be up soon it's try on haul definitely check it out but there is one really sad thing that i do want to address about guppy he is not dead before you think that actually maybe i should phrase that better as you guys know i am moving to texas or if you guys didn't know that now you do i'm moving to texas july 11th so it's coming up real soon and basically i made this decision to rehome guppy and it's really sad because i've spent so much time and effort into researching making his cage perfect or not perfect but like working on it's a work in progress okay anyways um i spent a lot of time and i love guppy he is adorable and he's just so he's just guppy you know like and he's like a staple on my channel he's the reason i get views apparently but i don't really care about that obviously but hi guys so i just wanted to get on here and clarify something really quickly because the way I said that sounded really fucked up and it was just a joke but I'd never brought Guppy into my home because I wanted the subs or the views 
honestly did not realize that there was such a large hamster community out there on YouTube. Like I never in a million years expected my video of getting a hamster and my gubby videos to like blow up like that. I genuinely got him because I used to have hamsters and I made a lot of mistakes and I wanted to fix them and take care of something. I, it feels wrong saying something about my hamster, but um, anyways. Guppy has been a huge part of my life for the last few months and last several months really. I've put a lot of work and effort into making, sorry there's a hair in my eye, a lot of work and effort into making sure that he has a great life. Yeah, I never meant to like exploit him for views or anything. I simply made those videos because one, I wanted to, and two, you guys were asking for it. So I think that it hasn't really hit me that like I'm giving Guppy away yet because it hasn't even hit me that I'm moving and I'm moving in less than a month. So I just wanted to clarify that and I know that I probably get shit for giving Guppy away, but it wasn't an easy decision and ultimately I do want what's best for him and yeah also before you guys come at me saying why would you get a hamster when you're moving and you know you're gonna move during the time that i got guppy i had no clue i was moving it was kind of a spontaneous decision decision to move because i got guppy back in what was it october or november let's check really quickly oh i got guppy back in september so quite the while ago i've had him for a long time and we made the decision to move in what was it like may or something actually it might have been no, it definitely wasn't May. Um, it was either... No, it was February. I'm stupid. Okay. Um, we ended up deciding to move in February. So I had no clue that I was moving and I wouldn't have gotten guppy, honestly, if I knew that because, again, like now I have to make the decision to give him away. We weren't planning to move until after my senior year and we went to Texas just to look at homes. And then my dad ended up buying one, so yeah, it was kind of a spontaneous decision. But I would not have gotten Guppy had I known that I'd be moving halfway across the country. And I just want to let you guys know that so people aren't shitting on me for doing that. Because, like I said, it was not an easy decision. And as much as I will try to play it off, it really sucks. So, yeah. Alright, bye guys. Back to the video. I've really grown an emotional attachment to this little tiny hamster and it's gonna be hard to let him go but we are driving to Texas. It's a 10 hour drive one day and then the next day it's another 10 hour drive. So it's gonna be really stressful on my hamster being cooped up in a little cage, like a little travel cage and just like moving him and everything. It's gonna be really stressful for him and I don't wanna do that to him and I just want him to just be happy and live a long life. And so I made the decision to rehome him cause I don't want anything to happen to him while we're traveling because it is a very long drive and it's going to be difficult to transport him, the cage, and just everything without causing any harm to him or any stress to him. So um, I made this decision, but I already found a new home for him. My friend Suhani is going to be taking him and don't worry guys, like Suhani is a super responsible person and I think that she will do amazing with Guppy, but... It's definitely going to suck and I'm going to be giving him away at the end of June because I do want to be here when he's settling in and if Suhani has any questions and stuff. So that's happening. End of June, Guppy will be gone, which is really sad, but I'm really about to cry over my hamster being gone. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> um, yeah, it's just, it's hard when you've taken care of something um or someone and you have to make a decision to give them away you know like especially pets obviously because you don't really give people away i love guppy and i am hoping that he has a long healthy happy life and i know suhani will do a great job taking care of him so i'm not worried about that but it definitely still sucks that's my life right now it's kind of going a little downhill but well we won't talk about that <laughs> What else is going on? I think that's the last thing I wanted to update you guys on. There will be no more Guppy content. Before y'all come at me though, um, I did think about it for a long time and ultimately I want what's best for my hamster and ultimately it is my decision. So yeah, that's my life right now. That's why I haven't been posting. That's the update on Guppy. He's alive, healthy, happy. 
I still have him, by the way, if you, that was unclear, because I'm giving away end of June. Um, yeah. Anyways, um, I will be posting soon, so just keep a lookout for my videos. And I'm going to be doing a last week as a junior, so that will be up soon too. Probably in a week because I still need to get through last week, but yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure you leave a like and a comment. Subscribe if you haven't already. Yeah, bye guys. <laughs>